Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, first of all, I just want to show you guys my beautiful new tree. I literally love it so much. It's so cute. Um, I got this last year after Christmas. Uh, it was like on sale or whatever at Walmart. Mom's like, you want to pick out a mini tree for your room next year? Because I used to have one when I was younger and we got rid of it a long time ago. So now I have this beautiful one and I love it. It's white with colorful lights and I picked out all the ornaments myself. I've got these cute little um, balloon animals, hot air balloons, these little diamond thingies. It's super cute and I love it. And this is like my new night light at, at night whenever I have my uh, lights off. I just like chill in my room and I normally have a candle lit. It's like a nice little like vibe. So it's super cute. But anyways, I just want to show that off. Um, hopefully it's not too much of a distraction. At least the lights aren't like blinking and flickering. But um, yeah, that's my new Christmas tree. So today's video is going to be a kind of birthday recap or and also kind of like a showing what I got for my birthday from my family, my boyfriend, and my best friend. Um, obviously this year's COVID so we didn't really do much um, like anything crazy but definitely a lot more happened than what I thought it would I thought my birthday was gonna be really chill this year like nothing was going on I couldn't really do much because the COVID obviously can't go anywhere and do anything um, we wanted to keep it really low-key at my house I was just gonna maybe have like literally my boyfriend and maybe like my family over like but not even like I, I really didn't think we we're doing anything and my mom surprised the heck out of me and I had no idea and I was literally so grateful like, I literally hugged her like five times that day and the day after I was just like so like crazy I was just like wow because it was my 16th birthday so she did feel bad that we couldn't do anything like super crazy and like spectacular which again I wasn't expecting anything I was like yeah it's my 16th but like I don't know like I don't I don't expect anything it's whatever um so yeah my mom completely surprised me I'll guess I guess that will be the first half of this video is kind of explaining the day in case I don't think the vlog's out yet I don't know when the vlog's coming out for my dad because I know they vlogged like the behind the scenes of like them setting up or something I'm not really sure but um, basically, like I said, my mom surprised me. She was like, um, she was like, okay, so you and your dad are gonna go out. You have to go go somewhere, and while you're out, you can get your free Dutch for your birthday. And I was like, okay. I was like, I don't know where we're going. And so it was like to pick up something, right? So when I went out with my dad, and we got Jimmy John's picked up, like for like catering, kind of like a whole box of Jimmy John's, and then we got a Baskin Robbins birthday cake. And like I said, that was a surprise. I had no idea we were doing that. So that was super cool. She like picked out the birthday cake and like it was super cool. Um, and while I was out and before that, like my family came over to so my grandparents on my mom's side. And then Chrissy, Jack and Mason, the Bevos, if you guys don't know them, they're my cousin, my aunt and uncle, my mom's sister. And um, they had their own channel, the Bevos. They came over and um, as of planned, my boyfriend wasn't going to come over until around 2 because he had like a photo shoot to do for dance if you guys don't know my boyfriend's a competitive dancer and so he has stuff like that that happens sometimes and my birthday was on a Sunday so he had like a photo shoot to do and he was like I'm sorry I'm not gonna be able to come till later I was like okay and like I believed him I was like whatever he totally played it off because I didn't think he was gonna be coming until two and I was kind of bummed out obviously like I wanted him to come early like everyone else and like be able to have him there with me like everyone else but I was like okay whatever I won't see him till later and then he played it off so well he turned off his snap maps like an at, like a day ago for like a different reason like he was like oh I need to turn off my snap mask for this reason and I was like okay like makes sense whatever I didn't think too much of it I was like whatever and so he turned off his snap mask so I wouldn't know like at where he actually was like which he was at my house and whenever it got closer to the time that his photo shoot was starting which was around noonish he told me he's like all right I'm I don't know if he I don't know if my snap's not working or if he said anything but I'm at the photo shoot now so I'll text you after I love you and I was like okay so he he made it seem like he wasn't able to text me back like he was at the photo shoot like it completely like just worked out I was like okay I'll text him like I, I won't see him for another two hours like it's all right that's how I had it in my head already so anyways now that you got kind of get that in your head I thought I wasn't gonna see my boyfriend till later I thought I wasn't gonna be able to text him all that I go out with my dad we go get those two things we get my Dutch and we drive home and then like the boys so mason and bryce come out and like grab all the stuff that we had like the jimmy john's and the cake and all that and i start walking up and me and my dad my dad's vlogging me and um i i, I go to the front door and i see a little index card on the front door it says and your hunt begins that, that, that. i was like oh my goodness this is what they were doing so basically while i was gone my family all set up a scavenger hunt and I was like oh my gosh so I, I slowly opened the door because I knew everyone was going to be staring at me like I so, slowly opened the door Chrissy and Jack are on the left my mom and Mason and Bryce are in front of me up on the staircase with my grandparents and I look to the right and I see my boyfriend just standing there and this is at like 12 30 so like way earlier than I thought he was going to come over he never had a photo shoot he never went to a photo shoot he completely tricked me and I believed him and it was just so like my face lit up 
like when I saw him like I was so excited obviously to see him I was just like ah! my whole my mom and my boyfriend planned that all to secretly like make me believe that he wasn't gonna come and, like they planned it all like that and I was like I was so happy to see him I was so like everything I was just like so yeah I saw him he was holding the first note card so he was just like standing there with a big smile and he has like the biggest brightest smile in the world like I love it and he's like standing there with the first index card and I'm just like ah! so basically they set up a big scavenger hunt throughout my house and um at each thing so they gave me like an index card and I have to figure out the riddle and whatever it means or whatever it says is where I have to go and so I have to find that place in the house and normally once I find it there's like a little object and a gift card on it so the whole theme was it was my sweet 16 so my mom picked out 16 sweet items so like cookies or candy or um like there, she got me an umbrella that had like donuts on it like it was all like sweet stuff and like cute things like that and then on each thing had a gift card and each of them is ten dollars so that was kind of that was my birthday present for my parents is like it can they kind of made it fun like scavenger hunt but like all the gift cards and then all like the treats and stuff they gave me was um my present from them which i was super grateful because i was just like that's ridiculous like so there were 16 different spots and each gift card had ten dollars on them and i was just like oh my gosh and so it was super fun to figure out all the places. And when I came up into my room, this is one thing. When I come into my room, these flowers are sitting here on my dresser. And I had a feeling they were from Garen because, like, I don't know who else would get me flowers. And so, yeah, that made me really happy. I just came up to my room. There's flowers sitting there for me. And so, yeah, I, it took me a while to figure out all the riddles and find all the things. But once I did, I was like, okay, I feel good. I had all, all the stuff on the counter. I was like, okay, cool. So... I guess that's kind of the main thing that happened for my birthday, like what my parents planned and it was like super surprise and all that. And then also my best friend Reagan, as a lot of you guys know, she ended up coming over too which was super awesome. I was able to see my best friend, my boyfriend, and my family. And I even got to see some of my dad's family too which we don't see as often. So I got to see my grandpa on my dad's side and then one of my uncles and one of my cousins from my dad's side as well. So that was super cool. Um, but yeah, that was kind of what happened on my birthday. Like I said, lots of surprises and stuff I did not expect whatsoever. It ended up being like an amazing birthday for like COVID um, situation and for like everything that I didn't expect. So it was super awesome and I was just so grateful and I was just like, oh my God, this is crazy. So it was super fun and um, the day was just awesome. So we obviously did that first. We ate Jimmy John's. Um, my mom made a pasta salad, so we ate pasta salad. We all just kind of hung out. The parents are hanging out. Me, Garen, and Re yeah, me, Garen, and Reagan. Um, we just hung out all day we kept going we went to the park a couple of times during the day and played volleyball and it was just an overall fun day and i just i absolutely loved it it was super cool the ice cream cake was a cookie dough ice cream with vanilla cake which cookie dough ice cream is like one of my favorite flavors so it was super cool and then also i wanted to show you guys so that's like i said that's kind of kind of how the day went and it was super awesome and like i said it was super cool and at the end of the day too when it got dark out me and reagan and garrett and, um we all went why does that keep sounding so weird for me to say? Like, it sounds like I'm saying my own name, but I'm not. I guess it's technically supposed to be Garen, Reagan, and I. Maybe that's why I'm... My boyfriend, my best friend, and me. I don't know how... Why it sounds so weird to say it. Um, but we all three went to one of the parks in our neighborhood that has a sand volleyball court. And we went there, and then some friends ended up meeting up with us. So I got to see some of my friends also on my birthday, too. So it was super cool. And then we kind of just hung out at the park on, like, the playground for, like an hour and it kind of just reminded me of old times like when we used to go after school and stuff so that was super cool like i said all day everything was awesome and i loved it but now i'm just going to show you guys kind of what i got for my birthday from all those people that were there sorry if i sounded like out of breath at all i just end up talking way too fast and as you guys know that it just happens and it's like i get ahead of myself and then i'm like oh, i have to catch my breath and it's like kind of embarrassing but whatever i just talk too fast um but yeah i'm gonna show you guys what i got and i seriously love it all it's awesome and yeah, so I guess I'll show you from my family first. I'll kind of show you in the order I opened um, everything. So for my grandparents, my grandma picked out this like cute little sweater shirt thing. It's super cute. I love tie-dye. Tie-dye is like one of my favorites. And it's kind of a thinner material, so it's good because like sometimes it, it, we get to that time of year where it's not necessar necessarily too cold to wear stuff. So this is like a thinner material and I really like it. It's cute and I'll definitely wear it. Um, and then she also got me a pair of jeans, which is great, because I actually don't have a lot of jeans that fit me very much anymore. I very, honestly only have, like, three that I actually like to wear, which, for me, I'm kind of leaning more towards, like, the boyfriend mom jeans, more than skinny jeans from now. So I have two pairs of those. One is, um, like, a light wash blue, and then one's black. And then I have a pair of skinny black jeans, and then now I have a pair of dark jeans for my grandma. And they have rips in them, but, like, the ones with, like, the stuff on the behind them and stuff. So, super cute. 
like I said, I don't tend to lean towards skinny jeans anymore, but I would totally still wear them and I still love them, so yeah. Um, that's what I got for my grandma and my grandpa. It's, it's like the running joke every Christmas and birthday. She always writes from both of them, obviously, because it's like it's from our, my grandparents, but obviously my grandma's the one that picks out stuff, so my grandpa always makes a joke. He's like, yeah, I picked that one out for you. Yeah, oh yeah, I remember picking that one out. Yeah, it's like the joke now, and I'm like, I always like thank him as if he picked it out, and I'm like, thank you so much for the sweater. Like, I love it, <laughs> and it's like a joke now. Um, from the Bevos, and Mason picked this out completely on, a, on his own. Um, he picked out this super cute, super comfy, like, I've actually already worn some of the clothes here that I'm about to show you. Um, I had to pull them out of my hammer just to show you guys. Uh, this champion, like, sweater, I don't know, I guess that's what it's called, a sweater. And I love it, it's so comfy, and it's so soft, and I just love white too, like, white sweaters and hoodies. But Mason picked that out on his own, and, like, he was like, yeah, I want to get this for Sierra. And Chrissy's like, hope she doesn't have one already. I'm like, nope, I don't, and I love it. So I'm probably going to be wearing this all the time since it's getting cold now. And I love it. So that's what they picked out for me. Um, oh yeah, I'll show you what my best friend Reagan got me. So I remember pulling this out and I was just like, oh my gosh, this is so cute. So she made this little, like, you know those like Spotify ones? You can get like actual ones printed out. But like, I just love the fact that she did it herself and she wrote on it herself with her handwriting and everything. And she has the picture of us being the cat and hat um, freshman year for Halloween together. And I love it so much. And on this, I don't know if you can read it. It's kind of glary, but it says fun the cat in the hat soundtrack and by Mike Myers And I just love it so much because like you got if you guys don't know cat and hats like our movie It's been our movie since like eighth grade and We like know the words to everything in this like, the whole script of the movie We know the words to this entire song and so this is just so cute and I love it so much I already have it sitting up on my mirror so I can see it every time I walk in my room I just I love it and um, she got me this dinosaur because last Christmas she got me a dinosaur for Christmas and I think this is gonna be like a new thing now Like I think she's just gonna get me a dinosaur every Holiday like Christmas and my birthday and stuff and so when I saw this I was like I love this because if you guys don't know dinosaurs are my favorite animal So she like I said she got me a t-rex last year. So now I, I don't even know what this one's considered um, but she got me another dinosaur and I love it so and then a little baby balloon. I do have two like normal sized balloons with helium in them hanging over there. But I, I didn't want to untie them for my door and everything. But there's a red star one and a butterfly. So yeah, she got me balloons. And then she also gave me like my favorite candies. So that was from Reagan. And then for my boyfriend, he picked out, he got me a bag of Doritos and um, circus animal crackers. And then he got me... He picked out this pink long sleeve for me, like the brand pink, and I love it, it's super cute. And the back is super cute, and it's super soft, and I love it. I, I love it, and it's super cute, he picked it out for me. And he's like, I may or may not have picked it out because it's my favorite color, his favorite color is blue. So I was like, I love it, like I love that fact that he's that. And then he got me freaking Lululemon shorts. Like Lululemon, so bougie. <laughs> um, they're just like, I forget, I forget what they're called. Like what type, what style of shorts they are, but Lululemon brand, just all black, and I don't own anything from, well now I do, but before this I didn't own anything from Lululemon, I've never owned anything from them, I see them a lot, and I just never really gone them for, because they kind of are on the more expensive side, and so they're just not my, like I've never gotten anything from them, so I was something of, like I've been wanting, and I mentioned it to him, so he may or may not have was like oh I'll get them for you because let me tell you Lululemon is his store he loves that place like all of his bottoms he wears like joggers and shorts are all from Lululemon he has shirts from Lululemon like that's like his store um so he's all about it and so he knows everything from there and like that's like like I said it's his store so I'm a newbie now I have my one pair of Lulu shorts and I love it and they came with the bag of course and he gave me the bag I also like this now I feel how bougie I got my Lulu bag I love it um yeah so that is everything and then I will show you guys like the gift cards my parents oh I guess technically that's not everything um my uncle and my grandpa gave me an Amazon and a Starbucks gift card which is super cool I love it and I always love having Amazon gift cards so you can use it for anything um so thank you for, to them too and then I'll show you guys kind of the gift cards I got from my parents like they gave me a really good range of like food places and stuff like that well they gave me an iTunes we got Chick-fil-A, Rubio's, Taco Bell, Jamba Juice, which is really cool. I can get smoothies and stuff. Sonic. I love Sonic. I love getting the, like, their... I just went there last night with my mom, and I got the ocean water. And I like slushies, too. Um, Little Caesars. 
Subway, Jersey Mike's, another Starbucks, QT because I can get my license soon if my mom lets me. Um, I'm actually able to now, like I've hit the date that I can now, which is up to my mom. She like thinks I'm ready and like wants to take me to get my test done if I think I'm ready. Um, so once I do, I can have QT to get gas. We have Cold Stone ice cream, Orange Leaf uh, Froyo, which is the place, sorry, it cut me off. We have Orange Leaf, um, that's the Froyo place that's up the street from me now, and then Verado. We have a CVS, which is also up the street from me, I can walk there. Same with Bashes. And then a Panda Express, and this one's cute because it's in like a little box, I love it. So yeah, those are all for my parents, um, and I'm super excited to be able to use them. Like once I can start driving, I can be able to drive myself places there with my friends, my boyfriend, and I think that's super fun. So yeah. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, if any of you guys were curious on kind of what happened with my birthday, obviously there'll be the vlog up that shows it all, and you guys can totally go watch that on my dad's channel. I don't know exactly when that's going up or if it already has. Once you guys see this, I'm not really sure. Um, I don't think he really has a schedule right now when he's posting, so. I don't really know when that's going up, but when it does, you guys can actually go watch that and see what actually happened and what went down in like that actual day, which is like I said, it was just awesome. Um, and then I got to show you guys what I got, and I'm just so grateful. Like I said, I I didn't think I was really doing anything about that. I didn't really think I was going to see many people, and I ended up seeing. I ended up doing a lot more than I thought I would, and it was just awesome. And like I said, I was just so thankful for my mom. It was just like you didn't have to do all that. Like that's just crazy to me, but I it was so awesome. It made my day like her just thinking about all this stuff and doing it for me it, just, it made my day um so yeah all right that's gonna end this video i hope you guys enjoyed it and listen to me talk and seeing what i got and stuff um if you did enjoy it give it a thumbs up and if you are new here then go subscribe i normally do type of things around art volleyball crafts drawing all that type of stuff that's normally what i do on my channel so if you're into that type of stuff go subscribe and um, I want to appreciate I appreciate you guys for watching until the end of this video and like listening to me talk and just hanging out. Uh, makes me happy when I have people that actually care. <laughs> um, and yeah, that's the end. I will see you guys in my next video, whatever that's gonna be. Bye.